All right, and welcome to part four of episode two, Heroin Residents. All right, let's get this show on the road. Should be somewhere down here, I think. Wait, have you never been here before? You said you knew a guy. Okay, not know him, know him, I know of him. Of course. Okay, fine. He's a legend, all right? He was once one of the greatest treasure hunters in the whole world. And he's kind of a hero of mine. What should I say? What should I do? I can't believe I'm about to meet Jack. But what if he invites me to go adventuring with him? Well, if I can offer some advice, best thing to do around your heroes is just act like yourself. Otherwise, it's weird for everyone. Be myself. Got it? Got it. Jack and Nurm's Adventure Emporium. Ah, ah. Yup, that's our place. Man, I've always wanted an excuse to come here. So, what do we have in here? Spider Peak Mountain, the Ice Crags of Doom. Focus. It's just like I told you, Jack might be the best adventurer in town. This stuff is from all over the world. See, Petra? Beacon Town has some pretty cool stuff too, huh? Oh, uh, well, I mean, what's cool about all of this is that it isn't from Beacon Town, though. Uh, but you've got a good point. This is a, a big win for Beacon Town. Push for service. <clears throat> Welcome to Jack and Derm's Adventure Emporium. Oh my gosh, it's him. It's Jack. Sorry, I'm, I I'm a big fan. You push the button. Very, very brave. I mean, I don't know how brave it was. I was just doing what the sign said. <laughs> there are lots of signs in the world. Not everyone's brave enough to follow them. <gasps> the warriors of the Whispering Mountain call me the Stab Walker. The Air Titans of the East call me he who slashes like thunder. But you may call me... Jack. So cool. I have lots of names, too. The people of Sky City call me the Groundfinder. To some, I'm the Wither Slayer. You can call me... Jesse. <sighs> cool names. So, what can I do for you today? Desert Temple? Woodland Mansion? Yeah, that's what we're here about. What's wrong? Uh, uh, wow, huh? Crazy glove you got there. Not that I've ever seen one before. Uh, looks real crazy, though. Crazy stuff. Jack, look at yourself. We know you're lying. Why? Yeah, come on, Jack. I... that is, uh... Um, yes? Found it on top of a creepy bottomless pit, right? Spitting out monsters. Yeah. And it had a slot with, like, a weird symbol? <sighs> you should have never picked up that gauntlet. It's not for us mortals to tamper with. But it was whispering my name. And that made you want to pick it up more? That pit, it's as deadly as they come. 
And that symbol you saw was the symbol of the structure block. Legend says it was a mighty tool that could grow civilizations like seeds, create cities in the blink of an eye. You need one of those to close your pit. So, where can I get one of these structure blocks? Petra thought maybe an ocean monument, because of the prismarine? Oh, it's an ocean monument, all right. The villagers of Mushroom Archipelago call it the Sea Temple. Hmm. No, no. No problem. Guys, this is Nurm, my other half. He's the genius behind all of our fine maps. Nurm, this is Jesse and Petra. Hmm. Hi. Oh, oh hi. I was just about to tell these two that I can't help them. What? I love your early work. Witherstorm, old builders, awesome. But as a purveyor of fine maps and adventures, your death would be terrible for business. But... Sorry. I just can't. Hmm. Okay. So how about you come with us then? You could, I don't know, protect us. Be our guide. No. Vowed I'd never go back there again. <sighs> Let me show you something. Well, do. It's like I said before. The world's a lot bigger than you think it is, Jesse. What? Yes, the empty square is where we need to go. Yep. And it's missing because... I, uh... kind of burned it. I threw it into a volcano, okay? What? Why? You didn't need that kind of danger anyway, all right? I swore I wouldn't take anyone else to that temple ever again. I refuse to let it take any more lives. Hmm. <sighs> Shut up, Nurm. Jack, you don't understand. We need that map. Yeah, and I hear you. I really do. But I swear to you, it's not worth it. I found a gauntlet just like that once. Teamed up with my friends Voss and Sammy to follow its trail. Neither of them made it out alive. What? What happened? Head Jack, inside, talk to us. Know, lava, map, volcano. You remember what I was saying anyway. But burning the map couldn't erase the horrible memories. And thanks to the curse of my perfect sense of direction, I couldn't forget the location of that temple if I tried. So if you're the only one who knows where it is... Yep. Without me, you never get to that sea temple. That knowledge is... my curse. Hmm. Jack! Jack! Sounds to me like it's your lucky day. Petra and I have a lot of great experience helping people get over their tragic backstories. We do? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. We'll tackle that temple together. You know what? You've inspired me. I mean, am I the Velvet Tornado or aren't I? Then yeah. That's the spirit. Yes. You... are, right? Nerm, time to get our adventuring things. Mm. Jesse, it's perfect. Structure block, sea temple. I know, it's amazing. Almost too good to be true. Ah, yes! And Jack, man, he is awesome, right? Ah, uh, I can't believe it! I'm going on an adventure with Jack. Eee! Let's just hope he's as good as he says he is. He's a little... blustery, but I get a good vibe off him. I can't wait to see him in action. Nerm, I told you, it's not the admin. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, fine. What'd he say? Nothing. Villager stuff. Nerm here? 
wants to make a new map of this place. Uh, what with the uh, whole lava volcano incident. <laughs> That's awesome, Nerm. Welcome aboard. Woohoo! He says, woohoo! Yeah, I figured that out. So that means we're off to the Sea Temple? Don't you think you're looking a little squishy for that? Seriously? You're wearing a vest. The vest of five fists? Gifted to me by the singing clerics of Port. Okay, jeez, I get it. It's a cool vest. Come on. I need to make a quick pit stop, and I can show you some real armor. Yeah, baby! Oh, Jesse, I'm so glad you're here. Hey, Radar. There is a lot going on. Someone still needs to finalize the ideas for the Founding Day banners. The cake-baking team can't agree on what color to make the front of their shop. The Woolmakers Guild isn't super happy about their booth being next to the Radar. Firework Union. Understandable. The delegate from Boomtown left word that she wanted to make a speech at the parade. Very odd. Blue hair. Smells like sulfur. Speaking of which, Radar. you should probably work on your Founding Day keynote address. Oh, and rehearse it! Why didn't I factor in rehearsal time? Stupid, stupid! I'm sure I can shift a few things around, maybe push back your lunch with the followers of Soren. They're very strange anyway, they'll understand. Maybe. And did you know Lucas left another draft for you to look at? I said you'd try and give notes when possible, but not to get his hopes up. And then I left a general block of time for founding day related disasters. I figured that would cover any of the various and sundry things that come up. Ah! Sorry, got in the zone there. Uh, what's up, boss? I see you brought friends? And a new accessory? Short version, the town's in danger. I stopped it for now, but I think this can help me fix it permanently. I'll be gone for a little bit. Gone? But, Jesse, what about Beacon Town? Founding Day is right around the corner, and if it's really in, in, in danger, who will protect everyone? There's no telling what could happen! Why don't you try leading them, pal? What? Me? That's... this is... Try not to explode. Ah! Jesse, uh, I won't let you down. I know you won't. Somebody shoot me Good now! Good boss! Beacon Town will be waiting for you when you get back. Good job. Sure. Ha! Um, goodbye. Oh. <laughs> you said it. Can't believe that's your assistant. He's more wound up than a pack of parrots with a jukebox. Or a creeper in a herd of cats. Or a squid in a, I don't know, a box or something. Anyway, he's real nervous is what I'm saying. He's a little nuts, but his heart's in the right place. <clears throat> if you say so. So, where's this armor of yours? Oh, wow. You got some pretty cool stuff here. Stuff I've never, uh, probably only seen, you know, once or twice. Not as cool as my stuff, obviously, but uh, you're well on your way. Definitely on your way to becoming a big hero like me. Not as big, of course, but, uh, you know, a real, a real great swing. It's just like I always say. Couldn't have done it without my friends. Yep. Yeah, friends are the best. <laughs> Love having friends. He never had one. Hey, wait, is this not where you keep your armor anymore? Yeah, I'm not seeing any armor. No, no. I just had Olivia install a little upgrade while she was here. That's a technical term. 
golden Goliath. Always loved how shiny this one is. Yeah, just like the prideful warriors of the Shimmering Plains. So tough, they like to make sure their enemies can always see them coming. The Ender Defender. Very fresh armor. Hmm, reminds me of the Pukjuk Slime Runners. Very tough cookies. No! Nice, I love that one. So stealthy too. Now that's more like it. Agreed. Hey, uh, can you just give me and Jesse a minute? Huh? Oh. Listen, with the heck mouth and everything, I feel like I didn't get to properly. Damn it! I then took the right one! For all the stuff with my sword, Champion City. So. I'm sorry. You won't hear it again. So, don't get used to it. I'll totally deny everything later. Well, we all have to start somewhere. Just... Uh, take it at face value. I didn't mean to cause any trouble. Okay, now with that sappy stuff out of the way... Let's go find us a sea temple. Jack, Nurm, you guys ready to go? Always. So, where are we going exactly? It's time to chart a course for Doom Sea. Oh. Shut up, Nurm. It's an awesome name. off the cliff, mournful blade in hand, and drove it right into the head of the Ikara zombie. I slept on an enormous pile of diamonds that night. Enormous? Oh, I can only imagine. <sighs> oh yeah, pretty typical day for me. You'll see. After this, I'll take you to this amazing woodland mansion I found. Yeah, let's make that happen. It's really far from here. I love it. It's almost certain death. Hey, that sounds really cool. I can't wait either. Uh, yeah, sure, of course. All right, before we go down there, I feel I should give you one last warning. The rules as you know them, how the world works, those don't always apply in this temple. Hmm. Oh, hey, what? Some people believe it's because this temple was made by the admin. The what? <sighs> Supposedly he's some all-powerful ancient person. Built the world, I don't know. But the legend of the admin is just that. A legend. A story. Bunch of superstitious malarkey, frankly. I've been to the swamps of Funja and back, and that's still one of the more ridiculous things I've ever heard. Yeah, I've seen weirder than that. True. Old builders, wither storms, computers. Well, let's just agree to disagree. I'll give you one thing, though. Bad men or not, what you're gonna see in this temple, it'll stay with you. You're good. Uh, we used this island as our staging area last time we were here. How can you be so sure it's the same one? Uh, perfect internal compass. The... The sea temple is directly below us. It's like I can feel it. Hope that compass of yours is aligned right. I don't really feel like wandering around on the bottom of the ocean. Me and Nermi got it covered. Picked up these enchanted helmets from the deep dwellers of Honbar Kavas. 
time to suit up and roll out. Right, now we're scuba diving. Temples. That way. How? Compass. Right! Oh, that's so cool! sure that we all have our limbs, how about we find that structure block? Uh. <laughs> I forgot they did that. Okay, that's not normal. a sec, just to check my enchantments. Yeah, gotta make sure they're all there. Okay. Well, I'm gonna scout ahead. <sighs> huh? What's wrong? Yeah, uh, nothing, nothing. Must hit a patch of soul sand or something. Oh, whoa, it's uh, got me. Like, uh, frozen in place. Wow, it's a good thing you're better at fighting than you are at lying. Because you are a terrible liar. What? I am... I'm an awesome liar. The deceptive... Uh, deceivers of... Lyar Mountain... Said... Hmm. Oh, fine. Fine. I thought I was ready for this. Guys, hey! I found something! Uh, be right there! 
Hey, uh, let's, uh, just keep this between you and me, huh, amigo? She's a fan. It's nice. Look, you have no idea how it feels to have everyone around you think you're some... has been. I don't think Petra needs to hear about it. So, just hush on it. Come on, Jack, you're tougher than this. Buck up! Yeah, yeah, you're right. I'm freaking Jack. Yeah. Nothing can stop me. There you go. I found the next door down there, but it needs that glove thingy of yours. What's keeping you guys? Uh, uh, nothing. Absolutely nothing. Let's check it out. Okay, that is cool. Sure. Let's see how cool you think it is when your life is on the line. Inches from the abyss. Ah. I know what I'm talking about, Nerm. Just do what I do, and you'll be fine, all right? Oh, really? I mean, yeah. Yeah, you're the boss. Yeah, I'm the boss. I'm the man. Close. Do you remember any of this, Jack? I... Uh, it's all a blur. It's a test, though, to see whether the adventurer is worthy of the structure block. Yeah. Okay, we've got guardian fish and floating water blocks? Water. Floating in mid-air? That should be impossible. Oh. Well, if I know one thing, it's definitely not the admin. Oh, you oh, won't listen to me anymore. Guys, I'm sorry, Nerm, but I think Jack's right. There's got to be an explanation for this. See? Oh. Well, I don't know about an admin, but I really, really don't like that floating water. What are those things for? And it looks like it's made of glowing obsidian. Okay, those sponges might be just the thing to soak up the water and leave the Guardians high and dry. Right, so we're going to use the sponges on the floating water, dry it up, and that should take out the Guardians. Dibs on that job. I think those stupid fish owe me. Okay, but someone's gonna need to run the other way and distract the Guardians, right? Buy you guys time? Wouldn't mind having some backup, whoever isn't doing the running. Okay, I'll run and keep the Guardians off your back. You and Jack do the sponges. Yeah. Okay, everyone, let's get nuts. Ready. Ready. Then go! Hey, laser lips! <laughs> What's it like being ugly and bad at your job? Oh no. No, no. S -s Sammy? Jack? Jack? Jesse? We've got a Jack oh. problem! I'm so sorry. Hmm. Oh. Hey, care to explain yourself, Jack? I don't have to explain my... Oh. You're right. I really messed up. I'm really sorry, everyone. That pile of inventory there? That was my friend, Sammy. Jack. No, I don't need your pity. I don't... 
I don't deserve it. I need to be alone right now. Whatever is left of Voss must be somewhere down here, too. I don't know about you, but I want out of this room. Structure block's gotta be close. Alright everybody, thank you for watching this video and I, we appreciate all the support you've given us and please check out our uh, playlist, you know, the next video, Patreon page and random video, I don't know why. It's random, so go, go with it. And also please like and comment and subscribe to this video and subscribe to our channel, of course, not subscribe to the video. Right, and that